Jackson is in. And down he goes. Redwell on the line. Hit by Eddie Yarborough. No gain on the plays. You see him right here. But they bring over Humber. Pitch out to Jackson. Whoops. Got to go the other way because he's being chased on the play by Hughes. And downfield it goes. Sneed was there. Incomplete. He's a dynamic player. He makes some great plays with his feet. Let's see if he does it right here. It's like a little shimmy as he goes outside on that second down and 13. Forced out of play as he former Heisman Trophy winner out of Louisville played for Bobby Petrino third and six Lamar Jackson will take it himself got a nice block in the play from his tight end Nick Boyle he picks up seven on third and six and has a Baltimore first down Bill rookie of the year starting the fourth quarter second down and five Lamar Jackson he got away from Lawson and he throws it away Hold several records throwing at Louisville. Third down and five. Dixon in the backfield. Almost picked off. There's Edmonds once again coming in. The rookie out of Virginia Tech. Make a quarterback change week one. It's never a good thing. Jackson. He's got some nice moves. Elusively working into the grasp of Jerry Hughes. Gain of 10. Both have great respect for one another. And both worked on the defensive side of the ball before John went over to special teams. Jackson on first and 15. Forced out of bounds. Think about Robert Griffin the third, Kevin. He's just 28 years old. And he was the rookie of the year. Third and 15. Williams inside. Found the seam. Brought down by Micah Hyde. 24-yard catch and run. Max Williams. Keep his eyes down the field and, and throw a dart to Max Williams. No gimmies in this league. You got to come ready to play each and every week, and the Bills have plenty of work to do. Second right. six is Jackson. Look at him. Well, look at the play fake. He puts the ball right in there, and, and the, the, the safety, Micah Hyde, is in position, but Lamar Jackson just gives him a stiff arm. And look at where you can get better and the areas where you know you can make improvement. I think that's what they'll do. That's that's what all good coaches do.